Hi guys and welcome back to another video. This video is very special. I've been to Oxford to pick up this black coffin. Um, it's five foot and it is full of Halloween stuff. So this is the lid and yeah. I'm going to show you what was in it. Firstly, there was this Frankenstein oversized mask to go on the wall. And then there was a pumpkin one. And then there was this fluffy owl, which I'm going to get a cage to put it in. Not sure how I can see him, but he makes a noise. That was kind of cute. And then we had um, this skeleton costume that was also in there. Had this little heavy belt buckle which has studs and stones. It's a um, cross, it's got a crossbow. And then we had like this little baby outfit, a pumpkin. They did have a hat somewhere. Where is the hat? I'd like to know. Um, there's the hat. I might get a creepy doll to put that on. There was some of this bloody handprint sheeting. There was one, two of those. There was a mullet wig. There was also another black wig. There was an inflatable bat and of course a witch's broom. My nephew's been sweeping the floor with that already. And then we got this, Enter If You Dare. Um, this little Frankenstein cardboard cutout. My little ghost cardboard cutout. We also have a skeleton. My nephew was quite scared of this. This little spider it is tinsely, it's black and orange. There was also little velvet ones which were black and purple. Um, hmm, what else? There was this little guy right here. There was a trick or treat bag which also has this cute little lantern if I can open it get the gif it has all bats all over it there's another one of these trick or treat bags which there were two little dishes that um, you'd put party mixes in which was like a haunted house there was a whole bunch of these little plastic mouse, which I'm going to sure I'll do something with. There were not one, but two of these dangly plastic skeletons. There was also this big bloke right here which is kind of tall, he's probably glow-in-the-dark skeleton. And then there was... a smaller version of him. Right here. That's a little small one. There was this really cool Spider web when I untangle it. That's really cool. There was a lot of this wadding which also had like plastic spiders and stuff in it. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that. It's probably stuffing for when I make something. There was some more creepy mesh. 
there was a glittery spider, some more of that stuff. There was a holographic, not sure if you can see it, vampire picture. There was also this really skeleton back with roses, which I really kind of like, even though it's like plastic. Um, there was this. Um, there were some orange and black party plates. There was some orange ribbon. Some feathers. Oh, I like feathers. Um, whole bag of bells. Some shells. And this all made this little bell thing. Kind of cute. I'm going to put them up on the door. There were some orange devil horns. There was some jack o' lantern. Bunting. And there was also some of this caution danger tape. There's quite a bit of that. Um, there was this bloke right here, like a Dracula type thing. I'm not sure how well you can see these, but these have got like haunted phases on them. And then there was like a big black sheet, which I'm going to find really useful. And a little squishy rat, a little squishy stress rat. Ooh, it's creepy. So yeah, and there's some glow in the dark stickers in there. Obviously inside of there isn't painted, you can see. And yeah, so it was quite a ride. It was like over an hour and a half there, an hour and a half back to go and pick it up. I'm not going to give a price of how much I gave for it, but I only bought this. All the contents came free. So yeah, this is the lid. I'm probably going to have it stood up somewhere. So if you saw my salad videos, you would know that I sold my little three foot Vincent Price coffee table that had the legs on. That's already gone. So I decided to replace it with a bigger coffin. So yeah, I just wanted to show you what was in my new coffin. And if you haven't, please subscribe. I love new subscribers. Please comment if you've got the time and like this video. And until next time, take care of all of you. Big kiss for you all. Bye, guys.